let's get started. For the first design I'll be using blue matte nail polish to paint our base coat all over the nail. You may need to do two coats for a block color. Use the silver sparkles to outline the branch, then fill them in. Now pick the crystals and set it on your branches. Finally apply a fast drying top coat to help protect your design and add a beautiful shine. For the second design start out by painting base with white color. Then I am taking a small brush and black nail polish and painting triangles. gold glitter, pink glitter and red nail polish to draw inside the triangles. some small white dots finally top it all off with a great top coat for the third design I'm starting with a red polish and applying two coats of that to my nails and letting it fully dry Your vertical lines with black and white nail polish. Use a silver glitter nail polish to draw outside the white line. Now draw the rectangles with black nail polish. Use a silver glitter nail polish to draw inside the black rectangles. Finally, apply a top coat on your nails for long lasting nail art. For the fourth design I'm starting off with ivory base. Then I take a small brush and white nail polish and painting a vertical line. Now draw a vertical line with violet nail polish. Use a white color to outline the square. Use a black polish to make a branch. Then use a small brush and black color to make drops.
only at the top code for gloss. For the fifth design, start out by painting base with pink color. Then I'm taking a small brush and black nail polish and painting the lines. Use the white polish to make triangle. Now draw a flower with a black nail polish. Finally apply a top coat on your nails for long lasting nail art. For the sixth design I'm starting off with a black horizontal line. Then I'm taking a small brush and yellow polish and painting at the top of the nail. Now use a white color to outline the oblique line, then fill them in. Use a black color to outline the triangles and fill them in. Now draw a vertical line with pink sparkle. Finally apply a fast drying top coat to help protect your design and add a beautiful shine. For the next design start out by swiping primer on the nail. Piece sealer foil over your nail and gently press it into the primer. Then I'm taking a small brush and black nail polish and painting a vertical line. Use a grape nail polish to draw outside the vertical line. Finally, add a top coat for gloss. For the next design, I'm starting off with a transparent primer. Piece sealer foil at the top of the nail and gently press it into the primer. Use a white nail polish to draw oblique line. Then use white color to draw under the oblique line. Once the white polish is dried, completely section of the nails with striping tape as shown. Finally, apply a top coat on your nails for long lasting nail art. For the next design, I'm starting off with a transparent base. Then I'm taking a small brush and red sparkle nail polish and painting at the top of the nail. Then I'm taking a small brush and black nail polish and painting a horizontal line. Use a black polish to make branches with leaves. Now 
draw a curve with a white nail polish. Use a white polish to make horizontal lines. Finally, apply a fast drying top coat to help protect your design and add a beautiful shine. For the last design, I'll be using transparent base and applying two coats of that to my nails and letting it fully dry. Use a yellow nail polish to draw half the nail top to bottom. Use a white color to make flowers petals and fill them in. Taking a small brush and red sparkle nail polish and painting the middle of the flower. Finally add a top coat for gloss. Mm -hmm. 